Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, and in response to the Secretary of State's response to um, my honourable, uh, the honourable member for Ryslip, Northwood, and Pinner, the Secretary of State committed to review the, uh, the airport's national policy statement last July. Uh, and it has to be done urgently. Our na uh, we, we, since it was originally adopted four years ago, our net zero commitment became law. Um, we've adopted a, a recent carbon uh, a budget, and we've held the chair of COP26. And the, what we know about the jet zero strategy uh, and the implications and difficulties of delivering sustainable aviation fuels, surely the review has to come sooner rather than later in order to incentivise change. Well, the point that the Honourable uh, Member misses is that we've also had the Jet Zero consultation. There have been a number of uh, presentations come in on that. We need to consider those carefully. There's a lot of very uh, interesting work going on. We will respond on that in due course, which will give us the context to consider Jet Zero, to consider the impact of COVID, and then we'll look at the NPS again.